Hello, my name is Garrett, and the following is a film project that I made for a class on French cinema. Movies have always been a window for me to not only travel to other worlds, but sort of see the world around me, the real world, that is. However, my perspective was very fogged and cloudy when it came to movies about struggles concerning the African diaspora, whether this would be African-American struggles, Afro-Brazilian struggles, etc. At first, all I really knew or was familiar with when it came to African cinema was Wakaliwood, the film studio based in Uganda, famous for their films Who Killed Captain Alex and Bad Black. But thanks to college, the fog started to clear up real quick, and I could go on about what I've learned so far, but today I want to focus on Afro-French cinema. Now when I say Afro-French cinema, the films I did watch, some of them were directed by basically just white directors, but a lot of them were also produced by black directors. So I guess to clarify when I say French cinema or Afro-French cinema is just movies dealing with issues specific to African French people. And not necessarily France specifically, but African countries impacted by French colonialism, such as Senegal. So, with this clarification in mind, let's begin. So, for starters, it was through Semben's films that I learned of how religious corruption affected the lives of struggling women of all ages, and how political corruption divided communities and families. Secondly, it was through films like The Pirogue and Table Ferrari, and again, I don't speak French, so I'm just going to butcher these and I apologize. <laughs> it was through these films that I realized the severity of Africa's economic poverty, a blend of people staying for their families to help them out, but also people who wanted to leave for better places. So those were the fictional films that I watched that helped my perspective, but another thing that sort of changed my perspective were the documentaries about Senegalese rappers. For the longest time, I always assumed that rap was just about drugs objectifying women and just senseless violence overall. That is, until I learned about the revolutionary influence of Senegalese rappers, where they rapped not about carnal nonsense, but about fighting corruption politically mainly, and even economically, but also pushing for better living conditions for the people of Senegal. Unfortunately, it is a shame that the messages relayed by these hip-hop and rap artists aren't as mainstream as popular Western artists, so it would just be nice if rap and hip-hop artists who are focused more on change and progression were, I guess, they had the spotlight more so than just generic manufactured garbage, <laughs> in my opinion, at least. So, in conclusion, I've learned a lot about watching and researching these films, and believe that they each hold important messages and truths that not just apply to Afro-French issues, but just African issues in general. I'm going to go on a little soapbox here, but I believe in the power of filmmaking to tell stories that need to be told, and hopefully in the future more voices will be amplified by this art form. And the same could be said for rap and hip-hop, as is evident in Senegal. Additionally, in my opinion, and this is going to sound crazy, but like, just, just give cameras to these people. Give cameras to people living in underdeveloped countries so they can tell their story the way that they see it. Because unfortunately, and this has been the case for like, ever since film was invented basically, was the majority was always telling stories about the minority and not for the minority. There's all these misconceptions and stereotypes that are sort of punctuated by like movies about these, about these places. So I think just give people cameras so that their voices can be heard rather than just like, oh, her dear, here's another bland boring movie about white saviorism where it's like oh i'm gonna save these people by telling their story rather than giving them the resources to do that themselves because i think that that's that's important that's all i learned from french cinema might go on a little more about this in detail some other time but yeah thanks for watching and remember to be awesome and stay awesome
You have to get past the Avengers and Marvel shit at some point, okay? Other people make movies.